Carla Suarez Navarro is a new mom. We're looking back at the Spaniards' journey to motherhood. Plus, we're previewing our last quarterfinal matches at Roland Garros. The break starts now. Hey everyone, I'm Johnny Ray Diaz. You're watching The Break. In September of 2020, former world number six, Carla Suarez Navarro, told fans that she'd been diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. And she began treatment and seven months later was cancer free. Her positive attitude during the process was inspiring to watch. And her return to the Pro Tour in 2021 earned her a WTA Comeback Player of the Year. Uh, Carla retired from pro tennis at the end of 2021 playing her final match at the Billie Jean King Cup. Now, two years after a cancer diagnosis, Carla was sharing happier news with fans. She and partner Olga Garcia announced that they were expecting a child together. And it looks like that joy doubled because this week, Carla and Olga welcomed twin daughters, Noah and Ona. The twins were born on June 2nd, just one day after their mother, Olga's birthday. Now, Olga is a pro athlete herself, playing soccer in the Spanish Premier League. She shared on her Instagram, I will be eternally grateful to you for making me the most beautiful birthday present anyone could have and for being a true fighter and brave. Now we're sending a huge congratulations to Carla and Olga. All right, half of the quarterfinal matches are done. Let's look ahead to Wednesday to see who will punch their ticket to the Roland Garros semifinals. Iga Schwantek and Coco Goff will play each other in a repeat of the 2022 Roland Garros women's final. This will be a tough rematch for Coco. She lost that final in straight sets. The two women have faced each other three times since then, Iga winning all of them convincingly. Beatrice Haddad Maya is set to face Anz Jabour for a spot in the last four. Haddad Maya needed almost four hours to make her first ever major quarterfinal. Anz Jabour is into the Roland Garros quarters for the first time. She'll hope to get her third career win over Haddad Maya. Over on the men's side, Kasper Ruud and Holger Rune will face off in the Roland Garros quarters for the second straight year. And we all remember that spicy encounter in 2022. I think both men will be hoping for a drama-free match on Wednesday. And finally, Alexander Zverev will play Tomas Echeverri. Echeverri had won just a single Grand Slam main draw match before this event. He hasn't lost a set on his way to a meeting with the 2022 Roland Garros semifinalist, Alexander Zverev. Live coverage from Roland Garros begins daily at 5 a.m. Eastern Time on Tennis Channel. We'll see you tomorrow.